Now we are going to discuss about how we can bring in special fields that uh, SAP workflow developer or the expert has created so that you can add more values to your SAP inbox. Okay. So here if I go to SAP inbox, okay, and if I click on inbox and if I click on the workflow, and if you see there are so many uh, so many things are there. Now what I want is I want some special fields that is already created. So if I go again here, change layout, and by I think by standard SAP gives you total 20 dynamic fields that dynamic columns that you can create. Okay, for a particular workflow task. Okay, now here you click on posting date, and I click on this, and I click on this, and I click on adopt. And here, what happens is you have all these special fields for some particular task that is already there now. So you can use this. So now some of them are empty because those are not related specific to those tasks. So now here, what you can do so that this thing saves, you just, what you do, you click on change lay, you can click on save layout and and this is a user specific we already created and I just click on adopt and I click yes. So what happens is next time when I log in back and I log in here and I click on SAP inbox and I click on workflow, I can see these other items are already selected. So I don't have to click on this. So this is my layout. No one will mess at it. And all these dynamic columns are there. So SAP, each task, you can create 20 dynamic columns. And this is very, very, very useful uh, because you can find who entered the reference number, the amount, whatever you can think of. It's very useful. And if you have, uh, if you're running SAP, you are for sure running SAP workflow. And if you're using SAP workflow for sure, if you haven't asked your workflow developer to do this, please ask them. It helps you. It's a night saver. It's it's a it's it's everything. On the eleventh hour, if you need to get some discount, if you need to get something paid fast, you can find it rather than going through each one one by one and finding all those things. So this is pretty easy, and you can get it out of the box from SAP, and it's available. Only the workflow developer needs to know some of the workflow concepts, uh, which you can get it from from the channel. Stay, so stay tuned to my channel and happy SAP learning and stay safe and wash your hands and uh, spend time with your kids and learn SAP. Thank you and have a great day.